patience versus also having to be some like one liner. Okay. Okay. Keith's gonna ask that Van Mason his mic so if I need one for you during the interview. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. We're blinded with Hey, how's that? Oh, there we go. There we go. You. G, -g, 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 -g unit. Chat should not be disabled. Why is chat disabled? Ah, we're gonna, oh, damn it. Why does it make it so fucking difficult, huh? Huh? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so you got chat there. second give me a second chat there at least now I can see it here Yo, hold up, what's 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 up,
for those who come through and be like wanting to do all the things I th don't think that they're going to work the same so I'm probably not going to be doing twisty bits and all that shit on right now I'm going to start filing everything you know start coordinating everything together Are putting things in organizing not coordinate I mean yes coordinating but not so much so I am trying to figure out which Sierra game should we start with I'm gonna start with Sierra I'm gonna start with you know I'm gonna start with a series of, I'm gonna start doing the series is different series of games if I have it I'll play it like I've got a, I think I've got all the space quest, or the police quest, the heroes quest. That one's gonna take the longest time. Um, what else do I have? I think gold's quest is one off. Colonel's bequest, that's a, that's one with a one off. <laughs> and we're gonna do Phantasmagoria, like all the classics that I have. And I have an absolute fuck ton of them. Then we can go back and play things like, um, I've got all the Warcrafts. Well, not all the Warcrafts, but I got the Warcraft 1, Warcraft 2. I think I have Warcraft 1 and 2. And then on 2, I have, I believe, the first one. And then I have the add-on to it as well. I had a, it took me a while the other day trying to <clears throat> organize and set everything up. Because, like, the audio and shit isn't working on a lot of things. What up, GTA? So, with that being said. Oh, yeah, I need to change the title. What am I going to play first? Should we start with Space Quest? What up, Michael Davies? What's up, Leisure Suit Larry? Should we start with Leisure Suit? We can start with Leisure Suit Larry. That's a classic. And I think I have, I think I have all but the two or three newest ones. What do I have? Oh. A lot of these I might actually need your help with because I don't. Re I don't recall. How's the audio? Should be good, I think. You had the spectrum? Oh, okay. A lot of these things I do not recall. You know what I mean? Like in the games. I used to play these all the time back in the day when I was a kid, no less. So. <laughs> and then some I played here and there in passing. So my, I think my audio is good. If the music game, mu the game audio is good. Alright. Warning. Legion Suit Larry in the Land of the Lounge Lizards contains some elements of plots which may not be considered appropriate for some children. Well, no shit. I, how old am I? <laughs> old. <laughs> I think I was about 10. So when did this game came out? I was probably about six, seven, maybe. Because when did this game come out? I do got to flip over and throw some. Oh no, 
let's Google it. When did eighty seven? Yeah, I was six years old. Fifteen thousand. A can of beer has a, no, we'll say 1,500, A, B, C, or D. No? Really? No way, 150 maybe. I was five, yeah, see. <laughs> I, I was a pup. A pup. The funniest part of it all was like the craziness about the fact that my dad would let me play these bitches. Hold on, I gotta go give alert to my boy. There we go. You're 42 in May? Nice. I'm, I'll be 43 in April. Uh, it's B. Fuck. Shut up, GTA. <laughs> Uh, I find computer games with adult content offensive, acceptable, repulsive, or under my bed. Uh, D. You're a kid. Shame on you for trying. Dude, I'm 42. Look at my face. I got gray hair, homie. We might not be able to play. I might be too... Welcome to da-da-da-da. Warning. How old are you? 42. Normal is D misspelled, yeah. What? Who is not a sportscaster? Jane Kennedy, Howard Cosell. I know that one's from, uh, Jane Mansfield. The world is near Fresno, Chingawe. Kui Chang Kang became famous by saying, I am not the crook. No, that was uh, Nixon. The barren fig tree, the barren fig tree bears no plums. Hi, sailor. New in town. A. Eh? No, that was uh, Nixon. I am not a crook. Uh, I. D, you think? Okay. <laughs> the techiest 70s fashion was platform shoes, midi skirts, short hair, bisexuality. What? A. I hey, papi. During the 70s, Carol O'Connor portrayed a kindly doctor, a lovable bigot, handicapped lawyer, a Negro junk dealer. No, that was fucking Sanford and Son. Handicapped lawyer, that was Ironside. Lovable bigot, I'm not sure. Who the fuck is Carol O'Connor? Wouldn't that uh, be all in the family? Nah. I had to think about who that was. Can we do something about the music? Jeez, I couldn't put up with that. That'd get very annoying very fast. Very fast. I oh no 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 get away from me dog get away from me dog Okay All right see we were in the ball and we got a hottie right there this dude's chatting her up chomp Uh did it did it did it sit down 
order a beer. He lied. He's not old enough. I is too. I prove it. Look at my chin. And I actually got an arcade behind me. It's crazy. You flip three bucks onto the counter. You down the beer in your pseudo macho style and slam the mug back on the bar. Oh, don't do that. That's rude. Suddenly, you feel a little woozy. Shaking your head, you clear away the cobwebs and you're able to once again walk in your standard, standard studly style. That's a mouthful. Get fucked up. Let me get a wiki. You don't drink the whiskey, but instead carry it around with you wherever you go, precariously balanced in a open shot glass. Don't talk to me, dude. It's a Wurlitzer. What's a what? Hey, actually, let's go see what's up with that door. See, I kind of know about two-thirds of this game, so a little bit of it's uh, just me posturing a little bit. But in, in a lot of these Sierra games, you got to be... All over the place. You rapidly knock on. You rap loudly on the Nagahide door. You wonder how many Nogs. Nagas. <laughs> had to give their all just to decorate this sleaze hole. Yeah. What's the pass of weed? Scram, dog, bruh. Is that it? Is that the password? Oh, cool. I ain't got to put up with that. I put the sound back on. My favorite out of all the series, though, is probably Police Quest. I'm just stealing shit. Talk to the drunk. Let's see what we can find out. Maybe he's got the password. Hi, uh, shiny. How about you and me having a little drink? Oh, give man the whiskey. I ain't got to carry around and spill it on my sweet suit, bro. Glug, 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 glug. It was a shot glass, bro. Slurp. Ah, that did hit the old spot. You know, you must be the only friend in the whole world. Shoot. I'm going to give you my only push. My only push. My only push, hit. push us, hit. my only push us, hit. all I got in the world, why should guy like me need to do with a TV remote, cool, thanks, you're welcome, one thing I do know about, anybody should ever know about Sierra Games, is you got to save often. Oh, great. Will that go away if I minimize and bring it back? Nope.
look or and you gotta look around a lot too. You are in lefties in lefties one and only restroom. The stench is overpowering. There is graffiti on the walls and you doubt the sink was clean even when it was installed. Even roaches can't survive in this place. You see many messages. One is Scott beam me. Scott me up, beamy. What? You see many messages. One is, attention arcade game players, please do not eat the urinal cakes. Well, that was awfully, what? They got a rash of problems, <laughs> some fucking arcade players eating urinal cakes. You see many messages. One is, it takes leather balls to play rugby. It keeps changing. Oh, here we go. Say, here's an interesting one. This password is Kent sent me. Ken sent me. Why look, someone removed her diamond ring to wash her hands and forgot to take it with her. Yeah, I'm out of here. I just scored a ring and I got the password. Bruh. Get the fuck out of here. Yo! Taxi! Yo, homie. Damn! I wonder what kind of brakes he uses. Where do we go? The cabbie says, Where are you t going to, buddy? Where to, buddy? As he swings down the meter. Ah, here we go. Looking for action, eh? This town is full of it. We got a disco that's usually full of foxes this time of night. Then there's the casino. And then next to that is an all-night wedding chapel. And then we got a lovely bar. You've been there. And a convenience store. Next to the disco, of course. But that's just press. All right. We're trying to get late. We need to go get some condoms, huh? You got it, Mac. Let's roll. Mm -mm 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 Gonna go get some rubbers. Yup. Yo, that'll be six bucks. We're probably gonna have to go to the casino and score some more cash. Oh, you'll be seeing me soon enough. Oh, stay away from me, dude. Can I bob and weave this fool? Bob and weave, bob and weave. Woo! Hey, get away from me. I mean, he looks like a ne'er do well. In your 24 hours comedian story, you see a magazine rack near the front with a sign reading This is no library, no leading. What? Except for the clerk standing behind the counter as the store appears to be deserted, a small sign graces the counter. Bottle of cheap wine and wonder how they make a profit selling this stuff. Only a dollar for a gallon. Are you certainly alone? Quietly. If he has any available behind again. Sure, we got lovers. 
Obviously, you fit in an area of expertise. What kind of lovers you want? Smooth or ribbed? What should we go for? Smooth or ribbed? Gotta have ribbed. Uh, color. Colored. Lubricated or rough cut? Lubricated, obviously, because I'm a gentleman. Stripped or plaid? Peppermint or spearmint? Spearmint. Okie dokie, mister. Hey, yo, everybody. This weirdo just bought a spearmint flavored plaid lubricated colored ribbed rubber. I'm not doing the accent. What a pervert. Whatever. He hands you the package and said, that'll be $6. Didn't I get? And I, yeah. Bruh. I hope you enjoy your spearmint flavored plaid lubricated colored ribbed rubbers. I guess I paid for it. Huh. Run, my, I'm sorry, but you have reached a number that is no longer in service. This is a computer. Get away from me, drunkie. Get away from me, drunkie. Get away from me. Woo! That man looked like a nerd do well. What? Oh, fuck. It seems a bridge abutment has brought your game to a sudden stop. Remember, Larry, friends don't let cabbies drive drunk. Thanks for playing Legion Shoot Larry in the land of Lounge Lizards. You could probably do better. Come on, let's do that just one more time. Since you're dead, all you can do is restore. Ah. I guess I give the wine to the fucking drunk, bro. Blah, blah, blah. That was bullshit. Here, dude. Hey. I ain't got no remote control, but shay. I'll tell you what. Here's a trusty old pocket knife. You never know. There's some kinky girls in this town. Shexy hunks like us might have to defend ourselves sometimes. With that, he stumbles off into the darkness. I mean, okay. I guess that shit was necessary. Alright, now I ain't gonna die. Damn cabbie. Ah, let's go back to the bar. I have a remote and the password is Ken sent me. 
Remember that. How much money do I have? Just a random mass amount? That's the case. I better get a drink. This is how, I, honestly, I, I learned how to type so well. That'll be three bucks. You flip three bucks on the counter, slam the bug beer back, and bite your kapow. You feel woozy. Blah, 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 blah. You idiot. I said posse. Har, har. Har, har. You feel lightheaded. Hey, yo, do something about that breath of yours. Oh, shit. I didn't get back. All right, so we're going to go back to the bar room or the uh, convenience store real quick. Oh, well, shit. Now I got to do this whole thing again? Hey, yo, meester. Meester, meester. Hey, come back drunk. Where you at? Let me get that knife, homie. Let's go. Give me the knife. Damn, bro. You smell like cat piss, homie. Where are you going? Maybe he'll give us something. Oh, yeah, hey, give me the whole list of where we can go. Do 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 Oh, shit. And he ran me over? <laughs> wow. <coughs> I'm fucking all the way up. <coughs> Sorry about that, y'all. Come on. Where are you at? I think out of the series though. Freaking uh it's the last time I went on the fuck I think what I was getting back to my original statement there. Um out of all the series that I had the most trouble with the Sierra games was um King's Quest. Get rid of the chat boxes. Ain't nobody typing. Top typing, and that shit is depressing looking. Twelve dollars. Sheesh. Police Quest is pretty hard too. 
I like Police Quest a lot. That's like one of my most favorite games. Naga hide. What's the password? Come on in. Score. Hey. Like a motor man. You want to go upstairs? You got to pay the price. $100 up front, no cash. He seems... He certainly has a pleasing manner about him. Huh. Yeah, let's watch some TV real quick. You click the power switch on the remote. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Oh, John. Oh. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Oh, John! Oh, Marsha! <laughs> Another boring soap opera. Seems vaguely interested. Oh, here we go. I'm Al Fartless, and this is my partner, Fed Ames. We just want to tell you how much we appreciate your support. Another boring commercial. The pimp seems vaguely interested, but not enough to leave us. Oh, I see what we're doing here. And now, Aloha Productions is proud to present the Revenge of the Software Developers in full color and stereo sound. Another boring musical comedy. Vaguely interested, yeah. While Jim is fighting for his life with the raging female rhinoceros in heat, I'll slip into my tent with the native girl in this picture of Mai Tais. Another boring documentary. Pimp seems vaguely interested. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. No, no, anything but that. Seems vaguely interested. Live from uh, Malaga, Malaga, California. It's the Cable Sports Network presentation of the miniature female mud wrestling 500 kilometer cross country nude bicycle race. Ooh. Another boring cable sports show. The pimp seems like... Now, fuck that. I'm watching. What's up? Oh, no. Shouty gonna win. <laughs> and next, Masterpiece Theater presents a special 3D broadcast of Nagahai Goddesses of Oakhurst. Another boring educational show. Vaguely interested. Oh, baby. Yeah, yeah. I love it when you do that. Oh, that hurts so good. Pull it out a little deeper. Huh? Oh, I got his fucking interest. Get away from me. It, appre it appears you finally reached the pimp's cultural. <laughs> Shit. Saving my money. I ain't gone to the casino yet. Nikes. Um, I just stole her chocolates. <laughs> you gonna just stand there or what? Viewer discretion is advised. Oh, look at that cake. Oh, 
Oh, I can't watch. Damn. I'm a soldier. Yeah. Although successful, you feel less than satisfied. Technically speaking, you're no longer a virgin. But for some reason, your thrill just wasn't there. You vow to continue your quest until you play, until you please your heart and not just your other organs. It's a good thing you were wearing your rubber. Let's save right here. I wonder why it does that. I ain't gonna go down there. Is it? I'm Spider Man. Try to spin the fire escape into something sitting in that east window. Ooh, what is it? Looking at the east window, you notice a bottle of pills sitting in the window's ledge. far out but remember that agility is yet one of your short suits how am I supposed to get those pills wah, wah, wah. we will rebuild them better bigger races to your rescue dumping your worthless leisure suit clad home hulk into their giant bit bucket for recycling into the future games their underground workshop is humming with the activity this is where adventurers are made not born hmm commander cabin quickly assembles a oh commander cabin quickly assembles a replacement larry while subordinates repair players damage in other here adventure games damn awkward send me back how do i get over to that all right i got pocket lint a knife a wristwatch am i do i have a belt why am i carrying a used prophylactic With your new body and ego, you return to the fight again. The battles of lost wages. Now you know what we have to go through every time you press that restart key. <laughs> what? to get those pills how would I be supposed to get that book I'm not gonna google how to get pills uh, I got a funny feeling I'm going to need those, though. Do I not have it? Pocket knife? Yeah, I do. How can you do that? Easy. You take it and you can <clears throat> throw it.
boss key. What the fuck does that mean? Maybe I use throw a thermal pod. What up? What up? What up? What up? Ito. Que paso? Dude, I got Hyrule Stream on and I'm lurking in there. Am I missing something? What's a belt? Oh, you know. Oh, sorry, bro. Sorry, 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 sorry. Five O doing. Stop, Herbert. Nah, bro. What you chasing me for, bro? We don't people exposing themselves around this town, especially wearing one. Of, why would you? Why would I? What? Why would I have barbecue tomorrow? Oh, you don't tell me I got my dick hanging out with the rubber. Hey, Rose. Yeah, I don't even think about... Fuck Eastern. <laughs> I'm going to have to do the, look at the walkthrough because I don't know, man. Larry can reach them by combining two short pieces of bungee cord and using it to tie himself. I'm craving a Wendy's? How do you get... After... So... I don't get those till later. Wendy's is busting, dude. Oh, shit. You discover Lefty's old left handed hammer.
I ain't trying to go to jail. Hmm. This motherfucker, this motherfucker will be like, hey man, you smell like ass, bro. How you doing tonight, Rose? Welcome to the uh, Twisty Play Sierra games. I'm going to be going through playing different Sierra games. Then I'm going to try to play them all the way through. What the fuck? What just happened there? Yeah, let's do it this way. Uh, if you go to Winnie's, what you picking up, homie? I usually do a number one double. I wonder if he's gonna get mad because I'm in the trap. I was in the dumpster. Is that what it was? You got it, Mac. Should I have gone to the disco? Ah, we'll go here and try to win some money. I'm gonna cheat the system, though. Nine bucks. Okay. Gonna get paid, bro. We're gonna make some money. Oh, cool. What is this? F4-1 ready to play. F6 for another card. F8 to stand. To change the amount of bet, type change bet. You have $55. So F6. Go. F6 for an, oh F4 oh okay so F6 and F F6 and F8 12 hit me bitch ah 18 18 stand. Seventeen. It's a push. Oh. Fourteen. Definitely hit. Motherfucker. Fifteen. 
15. Seventeen. Shit. Six. Okay. Fuck you. Then. Why it gotta be even numbers, huh? Fifteen. You wanna stand? Nineteen. Oh fuck, stand. Eighteen. Woo. Let's go. Damn, I didn't know how I only had that many. Fucking 20. Split. Can we split? Let's go. Nineteen. Fucking stand. Let's go. Make that paper. Maybe should I bump my bets up? Another card. Oh, fucking stand, yeah. It's a push. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Gonna get wild. Ooh. Ooh, what do I do here, guys? Come on. What would you do here? I'll let you choose my fate. It's 14. Your best to fucking... Your best to... Take the hit. 15 or lower, you want to take the hit. Bets must be a multiple of two. Dealer must must hit <coughs> hit on 16, but stand on 17. Okay. Insurance bets are offered whenever the dealer shows an ace. You may split a pair or surrender. Fuck it, let's. Ah, oh, I meant to hit fucking. Ah, oh. I meant to hit fucking. I meant to hit hit. Fourteen. Oh, definitely need to take a hit. Stand on seventeen. Yes. Shit. Here we go. Oh, shit, yeah. They're both 10. Stand. Stand. Bust. I did finish the hand. All right, back to 47. 17. Stand. Hit. 13. Oh, hell yeah. That's 21. Stand. Shit. They're fucking with me, bro. 
This is why I don't go to casinos. Okay, we got 11. Hit me. 19. Stand. Stand. Fuck yeah, we're at 87. Alright, I need to walk away. Walk away, bro. Save. I'm making that money. I got that money. We'll go one more hand. Oh, hell yeah. Stand, 19. Bro, hell yeah. Hell yeah. We got a hundos. All right. Toodles, bitch. Cabaret? Oh, hell yeah. I'll let you. I gotta, get, I gotta get some cigarettes real quick. Be right back. Sorry, I had to feed the doggos. I'm a crazy man. I wonder if we could break the casino. Wait, wait, they have slot machines? Gambling is bad. Cherry, 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 cherry. I need all cherries or all oranges. Well, let me get all bars. F4 to decrease, F6 to increase, F8. Come on, bar. Bar, 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 bar.
Hey, yo, I want six bucks. Let's go. I'm robbing this casino. I'm on a heater. Walk away hot. Walk away hot. Where? Well, let's go to the disco. Let's go to the disco. Disco. Disco duck. Disco. That'll be 14. Private club. You only need, you can only get a card if you already have a card. He needs like, but then you wouldn't, of course, you wouldn't need a card. So beat it. Where the fuck do I get the card? Huh. Do I beat him over the head? How do you get a membership card? That's an idea. It's just not a good idea. What's up, dude? Oh, shit. Where the hell do you get the card? He won't give anything away if Larry gives him money.
Back to the casino. Shit, I didn't say. Ah. Let's go. I had to look it up. I cheated a little bit. One thing about this game, you gotta look at every fucking thing. Observation is paramount. Disco, bitch. Last time it was 12. Nice. I saved a buck. Disco, disco duck. Ooh, there's a hottie. Why is everything filled with remarkably simmer guys all looking for girls? Watch this, bitches. I'm gonna lay the fucking smooth pimp talk on her. May I join you? Why? Am I coming apart? What up, bro? What's up, Mark? Oh, shenanigans. Hiya, baby. What say you and me get it on? Oh, we don't fuck around, do we? Get lost, creep. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Woo! Want her back. Want her back. How's it going, bro? How's it going? How you doing? Figured I'd do a little uh, playthrough of some old classic DOS games. Here we are. I stopped doing like I like you won't really see me ever and be just chilling and hanging out anymore. I'm I'm getting into animation, or I'm you know I'm really kind of applying myself to my animation. I'm I'm working on building out a cartoon. Uh, Don't I have a box of chocolates? So I've given her everything I have.
There we go. I'm gonna go shake my ass. Come on, Larry, what are you waiting for? Oh yeah, shake my little group thing. <laughs> oh, damn! You just threw her away like that, bro? We just... Sh that fucking hang time, huh? Damn, she used to. I just gave her all my shit up front too, huh? I want to make wild, passionate love to me. All right, you're gonna get lucky at last. She continues, but first we must get married. I could never make love to a. If you would loan me a hundred dollars, I'd rent the honeymoon suite. Then after we were married. God damn it! I gotta make a hundred bucks, bro. I gotta make over a hundred bucks. So I gotta. I gotta really fucking. I gotta get paid over here. Nine. Teen. Let's go. Huh? Ah. Bullshit. Stand for sure. Let's go. Let's go. Couple, one more hand, or it's a couple more hands. Shit. Should I hit or pass or stand? Nobody jump out at one. Don't jump. Calm down, everybody. I'll get to. All right. Uh, uh, let me let me fall through. <laughs> Fuck it. Damn it, man. was finished bro let's just get past the celebration split let's go hit ah I could have won too shit all right note to self Participation is not a question I should ask. <laughs> he finished. Bro. Let me be in a hurry. 17. Of course, why not? Wow, that was lucky. I meant to hit. Ah, 
Oh, this is going to take a while. Ace. King. Let's see. We got what? 10. 15. Ah, damn it. Stand. Wow, dude. Last $20 bet. This is gonna fuck. Oh! <laughs> Y'all some bitch bitches. Bullshit, bro. Wow, bro. And this is why I don't go to casinos. Especially playing this fucking game. Split. Let's go. 14. Hit. Stand. 14. Hit. Stand. Bust. Damn, he had 21. Ugh. Why couldn't he just bust? Why am I in a hurry? I'm in a hurry because I'm trying to go get married. I'm just trying to get to a hundred bucks. Definitely, let's split it. Come on, let's go. Fuck yeah, big money. Alright. We gotta go above it though, because we gotta pay the fare. Nineteen. Push. Fuck. Stop pushing me around. Mmm. Stand.
Got my hundo back. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 20. Bet. Can we split it? It is a pair, though. They're both 10. Bullshit, dude. Alright. Do one more hand just to cover some costs. Nine, team, stand. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, cool. Let's go. Let's go. Go. Let's 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 go. Okay, run up here. Look around. Look in ashtray. Get card. Roll out. Autobots, roll out. So I don't know if I'm going to do these weekly or if I'm going to do them alternating days or what. But I will be leaving these up. And I kind of want to play them through to the end per session. But after my birthday is when I said I was going to come back for live streams. But I don't know. I think I'm dropping them totally. Unless y'all can give me reasons. Or no. Like, hey, yo, no, dude, don't do that. Like, we like your live streams. For those who haven't seen me in a while. I have been um, on Twitch. Good evening, sir. I'm so sorry I didn't recognize you sooner. Please come on in. And don't forget to pay, spay and neuter your pets. Let's go talk to the sugars. Let's be formal. I didn't do this. Fawn, she replies. Somehow you knew that. Oh, I get it. I ain't hitting her with all the sweet shit up, for, up front. Enjoy my little dance show. Chicka 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 bow wow. Figure the boo. Figure the boo. Bow 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 bow. Dooka doo doo. Dooka doo doo. But yeah, uh, while this montage goes on, I'll I'll be playing more games than anything. And then I think I'm going to um kind of show the inner workings of how I'm gonna do my animation. I got one of those freaking drawing pads for for that specific cause. Oh, you're so sweet. I just love candy. Do I have any... hundred? I have a hundred bucks, right? What up, Talon? Oh, you're so sweet, Larry. I just love you. What game is this? It's called Legion Suit Larry. I'm going to be going through my DOS games and playing a lot of them, like try to do all the playthroughs. 
At least you're gonna get lucky at last. She continues, but first we couldn't get married. I could never make love to a man, not my hu that to a man, not my husband. If you would loan me a hundred dollars, oof. I would rent the honeymoon suite at the casino hotel for us. Then after we're married, we'll celebrate there. I just love money. Thanks, Larry. You won't regret this. Mm. Meet me at the marriage chapel near the casino in a few minutes. I'll get us a room. Hurry, Larry. I can't wait. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's a classic. What are you into this time, Larry? I don't know, bro. But whatever it is, I hope I got enough to get back there. To the... Oh, shit. I don't have to damn gamble anymore, bro. So yeah, I'm just going to run through my library because I have like, I think the first five or six Leisure Suit Larrys. I got all the King's Quests, all the Heroes Quests, all the Space Quests. The Heroes Quest is going to be what's going to take the longest. Over one billion, sir. Oh shit! Watch out, boys. I'm getting murked. I'm so confused. Which other ones? Uh, like Heroes Quests, Space Quest, King's Quest. Legion Suit Larry, the Minister, Phantasmagoria is another one. That's one of the, the most popular ones in my stream. The Minister intones his basso voice. Dearly beloved, we are gathered together today in the sight of our, uh, um, each other to enter these two and the people into the eternal bonds of marriage. Hey, Donna. But before we really get rolling, I'd like to say a few words. <laughs> Many of the marriages that I have performed here in this little chapel wearing this cheap suit before these cheap uh, shiny plastic covered pews with these electric candles looking at these genuine plexiglass stained glass win plexiglass stained glass windows for these um, measly few bucks he pauses for another nip from his pocket flask where was I he hiccups D digressing you answering oh well you got a ring he asks yep she's wearing it Good enough for me. You got your hundred bucks? Not me, you reply. I thought this was a temple of love. Sorry, buddy. You two are SOL until you come back here with a hundred cold. Hardly once, he says indignantly as he pushes you toward the... Oh, man. Ching us away. Oh, uh, then there's also, um, I guess I gotta get, like, two hundos. Shit. Um, there's also Police Quest. I think I said Police Quest. There's a bunch of them, man. Sixteen. Fuck. What's up, Donna? But yeah, I don't think I'll be doing any more, like, straight up ass, uh. How did I lose? 11? Oh. It counted it as one. Shit. King. Let's go. Double my money, bro. It's an F5. Just a moment, please. Oh, I gotta get like two. Shit. I gotta have some monies, bro.
13, 15, 21. No, shit, 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 shit. Wrong button, wrong button. Let's go! Fuck yeah, save right there. There we go, there we go, here we go. We're, we're on the way, we're on the way. Fourteen is twenty. What? There's the 200. Let's go up a little more because of the fairies. Stand on 19, for sure. Just gotta make sure I got enough for the fairies. Thirteen, nine, eleven. All right, save. Stand fifteen, twenty. This casino has a limit of 250 per person. You reach a limit. No more for me? Oh, fuck yeah. I'm rich, bitch. I didn't think I was going to need another hundred for the fucking... Oh. What the fuck? Woo! Naked man. <laughs> I'll, I'll mute the uh, sound for the disco because we've heard that shit already twice. It was 11 last time. Whip out your borrowed membership. Good evening, sir. I'm sorry, sorry. I didn't recognize you, sir. Yeah, well, you really put me through the ringer, bro. You and this woman both. And the fucking priest. Use the breast bra. Ah. Bunch of chodes that look. I'm wondering if they didn't take their shot. Fine, she replies. Lady, what the fuck, bro? She's 
Shake my groove thing, my groove thing, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, ow! Jump on it, jump on it, jump, jump, jump on it. Yeah, yeah. Wait for me. Oh, Space Quest is another one. So Space Quest, Heroes Quest, uh, Police Quest, King's Quest. All right, Larry, at least you're going to get lucky. Give it a hundred and give money. Meet me at the chapel. There's two versions available on the PS4 for four bucks each. I think I'll check out. What of this game? Uh, that one, that one is a, I think that's like number seven or eight. For Leisure Suit Larry? I haven't actually played it. I don't know. Where to? You got it, Mac. I will tell you when playing this game, don't fucking um, bring a bottle of wine into the car. This fool will drink it and go cray cray with it. Huh? Give it a go. I haven't ever played it. intones his basal voice <clears throat> dearly beloved we are gathered here together today in the sight of Ur uh, um. wet dreams don't dry and wet dreams don't dry twice yeah it has the one I have not played that one I've been thinking about getting it uh, um, each other to enter these two people in the eternal bonds of marriage but before we really get rolling I'd like to say a few words <clears throat> Many of the marriages that I performed here in this little chapel, wearing these little cheap suits before the, those shiny plastic covered pews with those, these electric candles looking at the, those genuine plexiglass stained glass windows for these measly few bucks. Uh, he pauses for another nip from his pocket flask. Where was I? He hiccups digressingly, you answer. Oh, well, have you got a ring? Yep, she's wearing it. Good enough for me. Have you got a hundred bucks? Of course, you reply, forking over your dough. I used to play this when I was like six, dude. Of course, close enough. I now pronounce you man and wife. Till death do you part. Or until you get tired of each other. And per the current acceptable social standards. <laughs> you may kiss the bride, he says, scurrying out the door to refill his flask. Bye, Jimmy. Not now. That can wait. Fawn says with a smile, I'll meet you at the casino in the honey hotel's honeymoon suite. Gives you a lot more than, and give you a lot more than quiz, kisses, my big, strong, handsome. Hey, wait for me. Oh, this is a setup. Somehow your entire ceremony, this entire ceremony was less than you expected. The sacred bonds of marriage is certainly get tied loosely in this joint. There's a set up. But I love a lot of the Sierra games.
Get away from me, barrel man. No, 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 no. Ha, ha, ha. Very well, then, perhaps some other time. Sure. You have 19 bucks. Do I save here? And it, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. I got a funny feeling this is a fucking setup, but I, I will save because I don't want to have to go through that damn wedding ceremony again. Going up, more like going down. Cha ha. Where's the door? door do I go to? Where the fuck is the suite? Just knock on everybody's door until I find it? The girls are here. This must not be the right door, Larry. Might not be the right door, Larry. Is that the smell of burning rubber? This must not be the right door, Larry. Watch it be this very last one over here. Oh, Bruce. Oh, Howard. Oh, Terry. Oh, Carrie. Whoa. It might not be the right door, but I want to see. My guy. Bobbit, is that you? Yep, of course it's the last fucking door. Oh God, eh? Get in the closet. It's my husband. I one through eight. I assume there's probably going to be eight for. Where's the honeymoon? Oh, no, there it is. It's on floor. It's on floor four. I saw it. It's a heart. I was really big into Heroes Quest. Oh, shit. Okay, hold up. 
Let's talk to this lady. Maybe that's reception. I think I love you. May I help you in some way, sir? But business... She responds pleasant, but business-like voice. Ask name. Faith. Unusual name. Say, <laughs> Larry. Is that a roll of dimes in your pocket, or are you just glad to see me? Ah! Exit. Try using it. Ah! I got no game. Shit. What's up? What do I got in that I can fuck with her with? It's four? So yeah, I'm also in the process of building out a cartoon. I'm going to call it the Floppy Nibs. And it's going to be like uh, an array of just goofiness. Yeah, sure. Clicking the door and locks come in, the piercing suddenly you shout, Here I come, baby. Uh huh. Uh, let's do, let's say right here and we'll say fine. Yeah. Motherfucker, did I save? Watch me not have everything I need. The fuck? Mm, okay. But the problem is, is getting the wine, the fucking cabbie will drink it. We gotta, uh... Damn, dude. Okay, I gotta think this abstractly. Okay. I got the money. I gave her all the stuff. I probably shouldn't have. But it gave me points, so I'm supposed to.
Probably should have read that. Huh? Alright. I got all the stuff. I'm gonna... What I'm... Hmm. Did I fuck this all the way up? Say, got the hundo. Do I got the card? Well, yeah, one of the big games that uh, gets a lot of uh, love in my stream is Phantasmagoria. I'm not going to give this bitch anything but the ring. gonna go to the corner store because she wants the liquor she wants wine so I got 227 Thank you for the love. Thank you for the love. What up, X? What kind of rubber you want? Smooth or ribbed? Colored or plain? Colored. Lubricated or rough cut? Lubricated. Striped. Uh, spearmint. This dude. This weirdo just bought a spearmint flavor strip lubricated colored lib ribbed rubber. What a pervert! Thanks, Big Mouth. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed your rubbers. So I'm at like, what, 222 right now? He guzzles it. See? How the fuck am I supposed to get wine? This is after the hitch. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Nineteen? Yeah, all right. Cool, 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 cool. Glass elevator in it. What is that right there, though?
This bitch is going to ask me for wine. How, where am I going to get the wine? I guess I order it? Do I call room service? I don't have wine. Knock on door. Fawn's delicate voice booms across the hotel. Just a minute, Larry. There's a click as she unlocks the door. Then a, pierce, then a piercing. Come on in. The door's open. Subtly, you shout. How you do that subtly? Here I come, baby. How can you... Oh. I think at least a gentleman would do is buy a lady a bottle of wine. Where the fuck am I going to get the wine? And it's locked. There's some sus shit going on here. Anybody got a bottle of wine I could borrow? Is there a bottle of wine maybe here in the cabaret maybe? So I don't want to get in the fucking cab. My wife just loves to go into the mo just loves going to the movies to watch teenagers get laid for the first time. Sometimes she even watches the screen. Ah you know folks, it don't get much better than this. Krista fart. My son just got kicked out of his co ed college boarding house. He got caught spreading rumors. What the fuck? At least the comic's whoopee cushion doesn't smell. Ha <laughs> ha. What do you What do you out there? A painting? Huh? Punch this dude. Use your box knife. Use your My uncle is a hitman for the mob. What a great job. He only goes to work when it's time to knock off. What up, Crystal? I gotta go fucking score a bottle of wine, but I can't get in the cab. I know, huh? He's a real killer. I only got 19. Oh, dude, I gotta make more money, dude. Sorry, I gotta bet. Two bucks. Aw, oh, bullshit. Stand. Push. Thirteen. Joy, I got 15 bucks now. Give me king. So it's gonna be what 18 or 8? Let's stand. Of course, of course. Why wouldn't he hit 20? Why wouldn't he? Nah, that's too fucking. Yeah. Mm. King. 
Let's go. Ah, shut up. Don't rush me to rushing. What's good with you tonight, Christophers? 11, 21. Stand. That's fucking bullshit, dude. Watch it. I'll fucking... Mm. Give me king. Hit. Maybe pop with some pasta. Ooh, nice. I had Olive Garden last night. I ain't. Twelve. Fourteen. It's a five card win, no? Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Uh, nine and five is fourteen plus three. Whatever. It's a five card win. In, in the casino, that would be a win. Fifteen. 17. I'm a loser, baby, so why don't you shoot me? Split. I gotta make money to even drive to the fucking. What did you do today? Not really much of nothing, honestly. 13, 14, 20. It's a five card push, bro. I woke up mad late. I did too. I woke up almost one o'clock. About pay for insurance. Let's go like this. What time did you get up? Ooh! Ooh! Shit. Nice. Why wouldn't it be a push? Nine. Yes. Fifteen. 
5 p.m. But I had a a p. Oh shit. Uh. Had a pee wake up call earlier. Don't you love that? Now I got forty four bucks, nineteen stand. Bro, I'm gonna I'm gonna walk this up. for drinking water late the night before yeah I know I'm lurking in a hyro stream right now all right now save now I got 84 bucks Me too. I'm in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 13. That should be enough. <sighs> they don't have Uber Eats here. You can't just fucking call to get a bottle of wine. I got a fucking feeling whenever I get this bottle of wine. That this motherfucker's gonna chug it, dude. I had to make sure it wasn't expired right. Watch this, man. Watch this shit. Maybe he won't do it because he... I don't know. Damn it. How do I get the wine?
All right. Oh, man. It says I might have to call a number. Actually, let's try something. Let's go up to the uh, room. Maybe I can use the phone. I think there's a phone in there. <laughs> yeah. So definitely ain't getting in that fucking cab with no wine. I guess Mikey's in here trying to talk. Well, quit trying to... I don't have kids mode on, numb nuts. It's the mods. Quit trying to call me a bitch then. Or get creative with it. No. The radio interrupts the Frank Sinatra melody with an obnoxious singing commercial. We're a Jack Licker, we're proud to say. We deliver across the USA. If you're out of luck, but you want to dine, but if you have, if you need, just need boots, call 555-8039, and now back to our music. Now where the fuck am I going to find a phone? Huh? What up, Mikey? I don't have... Can't say any bad words in here. Yeah, you can. Am I going to drive all the way back to the fucking... Don't tell me I got to drive all the way back to the bar or some shit. Mm-mm. Try again. Try not using the... Like, try biznatch. Huh? Guess I gotta go to the fucking bar, huh? I said I can't swear in here. Why can't you swear in here? Bro, I've been going to a lot of streams on Twitch. No shit. I've been running this fucking joke. Why is this shit so expensive? Oh, this bitch ain't got a phone. I thought there was a phone right there. No, my settings ain't that bad.
It really ain't. It's not on kids mode. I gotta go rest. Go to the bathroom. I gotta go pissa. But no, hold on. I've been getting going to fucking Twitch streams. Fucking eat it all. Dude. That's quiet on the set. Oh, I haven't watched it. I don't want to watch it, man. That shit seems depressing. Hello, Ajax. So what do you want, buddy? Five 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 eighty thirty nine. Yeah, that shit does not. Okay, I'll take it there, but I doubt you'll ever see it. Bye. This is like talking to Mikey on this fucking phone. Just sent three separate messages and none went through. That's crazy. to get fucking laid, bro. I should have bought condoms while I was out. How is it 16 one way, 13 another way? Nah, bro, I'm telling you, my settings ain't like... The only thing that's are things that are blocked are their political names. It's not me, it's YouTube, bro. Political names, my old phone number. Uh I believe Anna's name is um blocked. Settings not on my side. Oh, Larry, it's you. I thought it was that cute young delivery boy again. What might have happened is it did initially say yes is for kids, but I took it off. So I don't know, it might have flipped it over and never really stuck. You carefully remove the bottle of wine from the, the bottle from the wine bucket, uncapped 
unscrew the cap because that's class and pour two glasses she downs her glass immediately you refill it and she does it again her eyes meet yours you're sure you're sure luck is with you this time i'm ready when you are honey come on larry what are you waiting for lie down larry i have a little special surprise for you close your eyes because you're sure that finally success is at hand. Oh shit. Oh fun. Oh baby, that feels so good. Oh baby, oh. Say fun. Why are you, when are you gonna get undressed? Hey, what's the deal with the rope? What are you tying me to the, why are you tying me to the bed? Cause you're about to get robbed, son. When Fawn has security tied you to the bed, she grabs your wallet saying, you forgot to pay me for the wine. Pay you for the wine. Fawn, come back. This isn't funny. I'm gonna cut this bitch. Any way a guy can consummate by himself. Larry, it looks like the honeymoon is over. Right. Using the pocket knife you got from the old man, old bum by the convenience store you saw, you saw through the ropes holding you to the bed. You grab your wallet and look inside. Well, at least you didn't find the 10 bucks in your... You hid in your secret compartment with your consummate gambling skills. You should be back on your feet in no time. Fucking what? Her birthday. Well, happy birthday to her. I did. Check out. You close the door and it's locked. Now what do I do? Oh, I did this shit backwards. Oh, shit. All right. Oh, homie one, homie one, congrats. Here we go with this shit. Get my 
my money up. Get my money up. Seventeen. Let's go. Dude, I'm walking it up. Give me some good shit. to shit, huh? Fuck. Money up, dude. Fifteen. Okay, now we're doing it different. So Fifteen. Twenty-one. Shit. Give me a ten. That might work. He busted. Push!
I hate fucking gambling. I do that uh, pocket check to uh, turn out. Get that <laughs> shit. Showing two. I got a 16. All right. How'd I lose? 10. Uh. I should be able to split that. But yeah, I'll probably bring back a... I'll do a playthrough of uh, Phantasmator Phantasmatoria. Or Phantasmagoria. Didn't I call the taxi? No! That dog will pee on me. Going to the Quickie Mart a lot, bro. <laughs> right? Sure, what kind of rubbers? Smooth. Plain. Lubricated. Striped. Peppermint this time. Okie dokie, meester. Hey, everybody. This weirdo just bought a peppermint flavor striped lubricated plain smooth uh, rubber. Perver! Seven dollars. You pay him his money. Thanks a lot, big mouth. Hey, mister, enjoy your rubbers. Hey, yo, taxi. But I would say out of all the games for me, there's two, um, two series of Sierra games that I always had troubles with was uh, Police Quest and uh, Space Quest. Damn. You would think I get uh uh police quest and space quest. Those two have always given me so much shit. But you would think I would get frequent driver miles, man. I'm gonna try to get into those fucking get that uh Bottle of pills. Cause police quest you gotta uh zero in your your gun. Hey, you're fast for a big guy. Hey look at the SWAT. SWAT's in the video game.
What's up? What's up, sugar tits? Suddenly you smash the window with your hammer. Your future as a second story man seems quite plausible. How do you get out there? What the fuck? Sorry, 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 sorry. Don't mean to interrupt your TV show. Smell like a whole ass bag of popcorn. But hell yeah, I, I just uh, forgot tonight that uh, it was Saturday. I didn't realize it before I started streaming. Alright, let me rephrase. I rephr uh, figured it out right before I started streaming. I was like, oh shit, tonight's Saturday. Do I still have the rope? Oh, okay. Twice I've been in this trash can. I still got the rubbers? Yes. Man, twenty bucks. What a night, man. What a freaking night for Mr. Larry, Larry Laffer. Going up. Hell of a night for Larry.
Larry Laffer. Had to make sure I have my boob magazine. Let's go holler at Faith. In the portion is missing. You can make out the words. Nish fool. Spanish fly, ha ha ha. I think so. I love you, man. Help you, sir, and some. Uh. She takes one look at it at the bottom and says, "Spanish slices." Oh boy, thanks. How do you know I love this stuff? She tosses a couple of pills down, and then a few more, and it finally gulps the whole bottle. God damn. She begins to pant. Ooh, shit. Look like tonight's your lucky night, Larry. So long, Faye says. I've got to find my boyfriend before he wear this shit wears off. Huh? Come back, bitch. Sure name. Twisting her key in the lock and disappearing in the employee stairs. Example weapons, you notice an un Bad kitty. Bad kitty. Bad kitty. Bad kitty. <laughs> well, you clumsy catch your new friend on a retreating now. Oh, shit.
bro, what the fuck was that about? Not the phone call, this. Like, what the fuck, dude? What the fuck? I gotta... How the... All right. Tie rope. I did shit so bass backwards. So I got prophylactic, da 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 da, bottle of pills. So I'm reading the thing as I'm going, right? There goes that white suit. I know, right? Dude, I've been in that trash can twice. I've been in that uh, trash can twice, for real. <laughs> Jesus, Palomino. Hey, Megan. Hola, yummy of all the... Hey, how you doing? Happy diet egg day, hell yeah. Hope all's well with you. I saw you streaming, I think it was yesterday? Get off me, homie. Must love, must love. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm not doing outright live streams anymore. I, I had a, I'm, I'm quitting that for a while, unless I can come back with a lot of content. I think I'm going to be doing, a, I'm going to be conversing a lot more on things that I haven't talked to in the past. Like, yo, oh, yeah, yo, yo. Have y'all been keeping up with the news kind of? No? Bro, this P. Diddy shit though? I dabble? Hell yeah. I am, I am working on a cartoon at the same time, but I'm also going to be doing, you know, a lot of game streams like this. A lot of live game streams. Bro, that P. Diddy shit, though? Oh, wow, bro. I know, that's what kills me a lot. Because I got DJ equipment now and shit. It's fucking bull bullshit, bro. Bullshit. Bullshit. Yeah, check it out. I, sh I don't know how well you'll be able to see it here. I can let me pull this up real quick. Yeah, you might be able to see it. This isn't my only channel. Yeah, mine either. I got a bunch. I got that, and then I also got a. Um, I think I can make music with. What, I look new? No. Back to the game. 
game. Back to the game. Back to the game. I can't sit and play fucking music on here. It sucks. I think I can. I think it just will fuck my, my standing up. Ah, uh, much love, much love. She takes one look at the bottle of Spanish fly and says, Boy, thanks, how did you know I love this stuff? She tosses down a couple, then a couple more. Then finally it goes the whole bottle. Her breath breathing becomes faster and faster until she begins to pant. She's all horned up. <laughs> so long, bitch. Unlabeled button on her desk. Press the button. It appears fake is truly her name. Twisting her key into the lock. F5, let's say right here. Poor shit gets crazy. <laughs> oh, now, where are we going, Larry? Mm -hmm. We're going this way. I'm going to me too that doll. <laughs> But yo, yeah, that P. Diddy shit is fucking crazy, dude. I've been watching a fuck ton of videos on that. Selecting your own pay uh, personal favorite from the three available openings. You slice. Oh, shit. You shyly try out the doll. This has been the kinkiest thing you've ever done in a long time, Larry. You gradually increase your tempo as not to lose your inhibitions. Not to mention your self-esteem. Faster and faster you go until suddenly uh, there's a loud flashing list. Go get her, Larry. I'm going, bro. At least this time I got to get me a piece before it took off. Oh, hello. So long, baby. Rooftop garden with a spa. One corner you found a sound of gurgling noise. In the hot tub is the most beautiful girl you've ever seen. Besides her is her towel. And swimsuit. You can't believe she doesn't mind your presence here. Watch out! Wasting no time, you hop in the water. Oh, does it feel good? The warm swirling about the bubbles stimulating your nerve. As much as the beautiful woman across from you, with the warmth of the water soaking your body, you become quite relaxed. Who loves you, baby? She tells you nothing, but a smile tells you a lot. Have you ever tried it underwater, you coyly ask? She doesn't ask. Or talk. Eve takes your apple with a sweet, innocent look, raises it into her mouth. She takes a small bite out of it while a sexy smile comes across her face. She winks and lies back in the water, chewing delicate delicately 
Eve gently moves her sensuous tongue around the apple. Tiny drops of the apple juice glistening on her lips. Ooh. She's really turning you on. You had no idea fruit could be so exciting. After finishing the apple, Eve slowly slides out of the hot tub, her steamy, naked body glistening in the moonlight, barely covering her tremendous assets with the towel. She smiles and motions for you to follow her. All it took was an apple. Can you take a hint? Let's go, baby. Let's go. As you leave the hot tub, Eve speaks at last. Say, Larry, you really are glad to see me. Yes, I is. Yeah, I ain't gonna need those. You want me to grab the rope? Her assets indeed. Chicka wow wow. Daddy likey. <laughs> Congratulations, you've done it. You success, successfully completed your evening in the Sierra world. Lost your virginity and emerged victorious. I got laid thrice. So this is, of course, your feelings of success are short-lived since this is where Ken Williams has to tell you about our soon-to-be released sequel. Hey, Quinn. Come, hey, Ken. Come here. Give me your pitch. And give him your pitch. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ken Williams. <laughs> Sup, fat boo? Hey, boo. Hi, folks. Remember, coming to this very computer real soon is the next installment of the saga of Larry Laffer, traveling software salesman. I'd like to tell you the name now, but we haven't made one up yet. So be sure... Be sure to pick up a few extra copies, just in case our desk copier is screwed up again. Oh wait, we almost forgot to tell you how well you played. I, I did alright. You played okay, I guess. Yeah. Hey man. On behalf of Mark, Sandy, Al, and Marge, Jeff, and Chris, Russ, and Kim, Larry and Bob, Ken and Roberta, Bob and Marilyn, and or Bob and Jenny, Janine, John and Mary, Bob and Carol, and Ted and Alice. Thanks for playing and be sure to tell each and every one of your friends to buy their own personal copy of this game. Bound to get it down. Love you, baby. You know, it took me, what, three hours? <laughs> All right, well, that's my conclusion of Laser Suit Larry 1. It's midnight. Man, wait till I uh, play Phantasmagoria. That motherfucker's a banger, dude. It only took three hours. I could have done it in probably like an hour and a half. If I would have done everything actually in succession. What's up with you tonight, Grave? I seen Hyro just ask. <laughs> so, question is, do I proceed on with Leisure Suit Larry 2? 
jump to another series? I kind of want to do things one, you know, in succession. What y'all think? Hold on, let me uh, Google. Um, I don't know. That's a good question. Does... Okay, we can do it. Trying to see if there is any uh, nudity or anything. Lead us to Larry, too. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know. Why does it keep asking me from... I gotta find these pictures. Topless female nudity in a few scenes. One sex scene. Can't see, can't two screen in text. Monica Lewinsky. No, there is not a particular reason we just decided not to, not need nude scenes. It says that, uh, was lighter on the raunchy content. Okay. Here we go. What is it? The one with the five 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 thirty eight twenty five.
I don't think I ever played this one. Uh, hold on. Let me put you over here. Put my chat right there. Right there. Put you down here. Alright. I think we're in. Uh... No, don't get robbed, don't get robbed. Green light. Ooh, red light. Rank nerd. What the fuck I'm supposed to be doing? Oh, I can't go that way? Okay. Oh, watch for the grand opening real soon. Motolima, Mira. Where do I go, boys? I've never played this one. Swabs, drugs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Let's not fuck with him right now. I only got a dollar. Wee! Where do I go? Where do I go? Uh oh. Ne'er do wells.
two gone to hear you. Harry Reams. All right, let's get a layout because I don't know what the fuck I'm in for. Doors closed. I can't go that way. Okay. Can't go that way. All right, so that's the bottom of the map. Maybe go this way? No? No? Can't hide behind the bushes. Or I probably don't need to right at this moment. So I know what's that way. What's this way? I didn't go this way. I can't go that way. Okay. All right. All right. All right. So I guess we got to go into the. <laughs> all right. Let's go on here. Up here. Let's see what's up here. What's up, dude? Hello, Blondie. My name is Larry. Larry, Larry. Hiya. She blurs bubbles. Can I help you? Woof. Yeah. Find anyone saying. Go. All right, I'm getting an introduction. Okay, after being dumped by Eve, the woman Larry met in the hotel at the end of the last game, finds him, Larry finds himself uh, finds his luck steadily beginning to improve as he wins a lottery ticket, a blind date contest, and a vacation on a cruise. On his way to the ship, Larry's bad luck begins to return again as he accidentally steals a microfiche belonging to the KGB. Oh, shit. Tracked by agents wherever he goes, Larry must try to avoid the capture as he makes his way through L.A. A cruise ship, a resort, and an island under command of the Dr. Mysterious, of the mysterious Dr. Nonuki. Um, okay. What up, Sherlock? I'm wandering around Los Angeles. Oh, here we go. 
Oh shit. I put my dick in it. You bend over and peer through a knot hole in the fence. <laughs> On the other side, you see people playing police quest. How you wish you were one of them. I could be. Oh, shit. Yeah, all good, all good. I just straight up took a piss. Hey, it's the Quickie Mart. Oh, it ain't the same guy from before, huh? Buy what? Buy something with a dollar. Walk east of the front door and buy a ticket. You insert the paper ticket into the luck o buck -o machine. Machine video displays. Please enter your six numbers between 100 and 999. All right. What are my lucky numbers? Y'all pick my first numbers. Pick my number. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm just not doing uh, live streams anymore. I'm changing my shit up. Nobody wants to pick a number? Alright, I'll pick the first number. <laughs> What's the second number? I'll pick the second number. Y'all pick. Oh. Oh. 169. I got, what, four more numbers to pick. 169. Um, we did 420, All right, fuck it. Uh, four twenty again. Eight forty. Six ninety six. Nine six nine. Pops your lucky lottery machine ticket. Will I be a winner? I'm out this bitch. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, this is going to get crazy. Just to give y'all a heads up, I am using a walkthrough because I've never played this one yet. So I don't know what the fuck to expect. Hey, is she blurts? Can I help you? Is this the lottery ticket any good? Oh, I gotta write these down. Alright, so... 497... 230... 615... Four six three six six three and two eighty five. All right, four ninety seven two three zero six one five four six three. Six six three two eight five. You are a lucky guy. The last lucky life sh lottery show of the season is being taped right now. I'll notify the director that you're here. I'm sure you'll be called immediately. I'll unlock the door to the green room so you can wait there. I assume that's the one up top. Oh, by the way, don't get nervous just because you're on a live television show being watched by millions of people. Chuckles under her breath. You up. Bitch for that, bro. This is the one where it's, uh, it, uh, <coughs> this version, it'll stop you whenever you start typing, not like the other one. Oh, hey, hey, oh, stay, you poo-poo, cries out the man, you're late, where have you been, you silly little dickens, we've just been worried sick about, we've, we've just been worried sick about you, you can answer him, before you can answer him, he says, hurry up, honey, you're on, okay, girl, I'm on my way, sister, Shit. The control room talking back speaker crackles. Five seconds there, boys and girls. Five seconds there. Places there, buddy. All right, let me get up in there. This doesn't look at all like what you expected a lottery show to look like. But just in case, you decide to grab a seat on that empty stool over yonder. Mmm. Looking for love in all the wrong places. The voiceover announcer says, From Hollywood, it's the latest and greatest in embarrassment programming. The all new Dating Connection. And here's your host, Beef Barf. Thank you. Welcome, welcome, everybody. I'm so glad you're here for our new dating connection. We're just about to ready to play our games, so let's meet our contestants. Who's going to make their big dating connection today? Beth. Today's lovely bachelorette is Barbara Bimbo of Airhead, California. Barbara's hobbies are computer programming, creating unusual milkshakes, and tantalizing elderly men. She lists her turn offs as turn ons as industrial grade blenders and RS-232 interfacing. Turns off include international military conflicts and the aroma of rosin core solder solder. On the left is bachelor number one, a professional surfboard waxer from Gumbo, Missouri. What? His hobbies include cool oh. On the left is bachelor number one, a professional surfboard waxer from Gumbo, Missouri. His hobbies include collecting Braunschweiger casings, speculating on the sexual preferences of professional dancers, and watching televised opera with the sound off. What? Neat, 
Davy Blair. <sighs> Bachelor number two today is token in intellectual. He is presently the chairman of the physics department at our local university, FU. Originally from Pakistan, Ohio, meet Raguka Singh Soon. Hey, that's not your name. Uh, excuse me, you shout. My name is Larry, Larry Laffrey. Okay, Ragu Raguka Larry responds a bit. Whatever you want to call yourself is okay with me. And on the far right today, bachelor number three, a journalist, journalism major who quit college in order to pursue his dream job. Fact checker on the National Inquiry newspaper. Currently unemployed, meet AP Wire. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's time to play the dating connection, says Barf, Biff Barf. Barbara, may we have your first question, please? Okay, like, thanks, Biff, you know. Bachelor number one, like, this one's for you. If I was to go out on you, go, like, <laughs> <coughs> hard to do my voice with this. If I was, like, if I was to, like, to go, like, out on a date, you know, a date with you, and you was, like, all dressed up or something, and you, like, and, like, the car busted, and we had to walk for help, and I, like, broke, a, a, you know, a hill, like, how would you fix it? Like, you know, seems to be here, obviously, her elevator doesn't reach to the penthouse. <laughs> Why beautiful? If you were with me, you wouldn't have to worry about an, any old breakdown. We'd be cruising in my brand new Porsche, and you wouldn't have to care in the world. Besides, if something did happen to your hill, I'd just sweep you up in these muscular arms and carry you wherever you wanted to go. When a top-notch physical specimen like me... A light feather like you would be a breeze. You don't even know what she look like, bro. <laughs> you're sure not even... You're sure not even this mental midget would fall for a cornball like that. Jeez, how romantic she gushes. What more could any girl want? Well, bachelor number one? You're number one with me. So much for that theory. And how about you, bachelor number two, she asks. How would you solve this puzzle? That's your cue. You're on. Well, Ragucka Larry, promise Biff, you're, we're waiting for your answer. Oh. Oh, I didn't know I was supposed to type. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who let in that jerk? What a putz. Barbara attempts to assume the end of an expression now, but... Bachelor Bar Bachelorette Barbie, my deepest personal feelings are too far too sexy for me to even allow you to leave my highly expensive beachfront swinging bachelor apartment. You and I would spend all of our time together alone, sharing each other in every way, if you know what I mean. How's that for a way with words? What more can any girl want? You may be bachelor number three on this gun, but you're number one in my heart. That's weird. Uh, 
Robert, in my opinion, you just asked for one of the best questions ever. Now, do you think you could come up with another great question? I got the next one. They only gave me like, they didn't give me enough. <sighs> Burns off a few million brain cells attempting to raise to the occasion. Okay, thanks, Biff, you know. Says Robert, Barcelona number one. This one's for you. Like, if you was, oh, uh, you know, insect and like I was a, a, you know, flower, what kind of insect would you like to be and kind of flower am I? I'd be a beautiful butterfly and you'd be my tender little buttercup. We'd build a wonderful garden of love. You are quite the charmer, aren't you, number one? I'd love to sow a few seeds with you. What a hoe. Bro, Biff, she says. Must I, like, waste our time asking El Dorco this question? Biff responds, why, of course, Bachelor. You must follow the rules. Okay, boar number two, she says sarcastically. Can you even, like, remember the question? I, they don't give me enough. <laughs> We're going to do it man, caveman style. I didn't make a fuck all. I knew I wasn't going to. Well, bachelor number three, I can't wait to see what you say. You'd be my precious little American Beauty Rose, and I'd be your little bumblebee. Stole my shit. He stole my moon. My little pawn on my stinger. Uh-huh. Well, number three, we certainly are over obsessed little devil, aren't we? Barbara gushes. Hold it right there, Interject. I'm afraid all the time we have for the questions today, Bachelor. It's time for you to make your dating connection. Number one. Both? Yep. Yeah. Yes, but I'm sure the audience has already made its decision. I made my decision, you know. Two. I bet it's one. Okay, Bachelor Number two it is. Huh? Did he say bachelor number two? Wait, Biff. Shut up. I wanted bachelor number three. Nope. I'm sorry. The rules are clearly stated. The first decision is final. Let's find out what they won. It's a cruise. <laughs> Ooh. Yes, a romantic cruise of the South Pacific on the beautiful USS Love Tug. You'll spend a solid month together exploring the exotic ports of the of call courtesy of Wonder Cruise Lines. <laughs> Remember if it's a cruise, it's if it's rem I shouldn't be dictating right now. Remember, if it's a good cruise, it's a wonder. And for our lucky contestants, why you lucky fellows have won a year's supply of armadillo polish. Twin really here for our lucky couple. <laughs> Be sure to tune in tomorrow night. Same time, same station for the finest and embarrassing programming. The all new Dating Connection. Good night. The control speaker room crackles. Okay gang, that's another one for the can. Ragucka Larry, please report to the grand room to receive your prizes just to stay. The rest of you just stay where you are. I gotta go to the restroom. I'm doing the pee pee dance, y'all. Gosh, Larry, what good luck you have winning a fun filled month long cruise with that lovely bachelorette, Barbara. Hey, what's up, girl? 
Look at you with disdain. Well, after I must admit, none of us in the control room expected you to win. I'm sir, not proud of the outcome, but the rules are the rules, I suppose. Here is your cruise ship ticket. All of us here at the dating connection with you, the best of luck. You'll need it. Whew. Hold on one second. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. Hold on, I need to, uh... Oh, shit. Hold on. Wrong button. Wrong button. Clear that out, because Hyrule is done with his stream. Uh... <laughs> While we wait here, apparently, I'd like to tell you about today's episode. It's been brought to you by Fig Newtons. Mm. Oh, it's her. <clears throat> oh, sorry. I just wanted a date connection. <coughs> Big deal. You were supposed to wait here, and now hurry up and follow me. Giddy up, bro. Run, motherfucker. Run. Hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, we finally found him, says the Master of Ceremony. Yes, we found our latest Lucky Life contestant of this week's show. And here he is now, Mr. Larry... Uh, double check the teleprompter. Laffer. Yes, Mr. Larry Laffer. Mr. Laffer, we don't have time for our normal introduction chit chat. Just step right up to the wheel and give her a big old spin. Under his breath, MCM. Hurry up, Laffer. We're already running late because you couldn't find you. Sorry, I was busy getting late, bro. Nervous that you reached the wheel knowing a full well that a pleasure of America's 3D graphic animated adventure game players is riding on the luck of your pool. <laughs> What does he get? What do I get? Oh shit, let's go. He did it. He did it. He won the big one. Ladies and gentlemen, Larry Laffer has just won the largest prize in the history of the lottery. A million dollars a year for life. What? What? Come on over here, Lucky Larry. Here comes the lovely Lana Light. <laughs> the Lucky Life Lottery Lady with Larry Laffer's first year's winnings and the U.S. Treasury Department's first $1 million bit. Why am I going to catch that, bro? On behalf of the Lucky Life Lottery, I am pleased to... Hey, Larry, can you spare me a meal? Oh, shit, let me get halves, bro. Let's go have these. I'm pleased to present you our grand prize, one million dollars. Congratulations, Mr. Laffer, says the MC. You're a lucky man. 
too bad we don't have time for a speech. Speech, speech. Let's hear it for him, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Larry Lapper. <laughs> the luckiest guy in Los Angeles. <sighs> Forget my face, because fuck I out. That is it for this week's show, but be sure to tune in next week for Long Hollywood. Good night. Oh, kids. There's another one that's good enough for... There's another one that's good enough for... Who is it for? Please exit through the door to the left. There will be plenty of reporters and photographers waiting for you. Let's go. Jeez, Larry, are finally beginning things go your way. First you went a month long of voyage with this bitch. And then now you win the lottery's biggest prize in history. Something to tell you, this is good, too, too good to last, homie. Guess they must have had a fast breaking. All right. Well, let's go. Let's go have a fancy dinner. Shit. Hey, Larry. Let me let me get a hundred grand, bro. I'm rich, bitch. Oh hell yeah. I'm Larry motherfucking Laffy. You better ask somebody. Oh, shit. Do I get a new suit? One and a half mil. Swimsuits half off. Oh, hell yeah. I'm a new one for the... Tight spandex job in blue, although it's a cut a little tight. Perhaps you may work your advantage on the ship. It might be the beginning of a whole new Larry. Why are you tapping your fingers, girl? Do you have any change for a million? But of course. This is a trivial little clearance item you're going to purchase today. Yes, ma'am. I only got a million on me. All right. Well, that'll be one hundred thousand five, one hundred six thousand five hundred dollars, including tax. That'll bring you charged to eight hundred ninety-three thousand five hundred dollars. That's one hundred dollars. Two. Oh my God. Wad Odo. Hide behind a bush. I'm gonna go try and win Eve back, yeah? Until your suit turns off white, you discovered your passport. Oh, hell yeah. I'm gonna need that. Smell like a combination of cheap department store credit bills, credit card bills, and roadkill. Alright, get the passport, walk east two screens. Bro, can you imagine?
Yeah, while I'm here, might as well go get a haircut. Giddy 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 goo. Oi, oui, monsieur, but of course, replies the barber. Allow me to correct the receding hairline you of yours with my patent and special pri proprietary technique. Microbiotic style reweaving. Just sit in the chair, please. Huh? <laughs> Wait. There's boobs. You think to yourself, this is exactly what I need. A new look. I'll make that bachelor at change her tune. Okay. Go for it. Swish, swish. This is going to be like a TikTok show. All that was? Yes, I mean. And let me to begin with a thorough cleansing to rid your hair and scalp of any possible pollutants, says the barber. I assure you. I use only the trendiest products, all organically grown and available only in the undersized, overpriced, biodegradable bottles. Huh? This, this we. You wonder yourself, what will I look like when he's done? Will I be handsome? Will I ever find true love? This is what you think you're gonna look like, my G? Gonna be a hunk. You certainly have interesting daydreams. A cat pissing on a. Hey, Brutus, get out of here! Your hair is clean in condition. Now for a special styling. Tons of plastic surgery will work. However, in the future, may I recommend 10 W40 and no more than 3,000, no more than 3,000 miles between all your changes. <laughs> <coughs> but it's not summer, dude, or it's not winter. You want to go 10, well, yeah. Yeah. At least do 10 W30. Hold on. Take a look in the mirror. What do you think? Oh well, you can't judge a book by its cover. That'll be fine, you tell the barber. Say, exactly how could I know I was getting a macrobiotic styling? Busy price. Looking like Tommy Lee Ducky. Right? Kind of did. That'll be $100. Says the barber. Thanks, I guess. You say flipping the barber one of your C notes. Ah, oh, have a nice day. We read mon ami. Chanson. So I need to go. A hundred bucks? I know, dude. I mean, it is L.A. Walk north two screens. Oh. I know why he named this shit Reams. Because you get Reams going into that bitch. Yeah. I should probably save. What am I doing in here? Oh yeah, I probably need to get some supplies, huh? Where the fuck is it? Uh, 
<laughs> oh shit, sorry, 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 sorry. I'd like to pay for this. Do you have change for a hundred? No, but feel free to give me a big tip. But of course, my good man. You tell him suddenly putting on airs, having a hundred effect, you have have two. Money mean, means nothing to me. Bruh! Rogers! Like, thanks, dude. Now let me go back to sleep. He concludes with, have a nice day. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, hell yeah. Gotta go get some condoms. Bro. Ha! <laughs> Suicide! Cup that large might take some time to fill. Might take forever to fill. Can I get a forklift? Oh shucks, this is real life, but merely an incredible simulation. You decide to put it in your pocket along with everything else. What? <laughs> ah, I hope this don't fuck my back up. <laughs> Do you got any condoms? Have a nice day. Did I not get condoms? This bitch called sort of... The store is finally open for business. Nice. Oh, damn. Is that a French one? wonder which ethnic subculture makes such expensive use of electric amplifiers in a drum set. Um, this might not bode well. Don't you ever say book to me again. <laughs> Right. 
Hi, beautiful. You took to talk to this little smooth mouth on the lovely Latin lady. My name is Larry, Larry Laffrey. Buenos dias, señor dos asistente. Billa bueno, la señorita el tacos. Good day, sir. How may I help you? That's not what she said. She said, good day, Mr. Two assistants. Bello bono. I don't know what that is. The, the lady does. El tacos is not a word. Suddenly she smiles brightly as if she recognizes you. Makes you glad you took Spanish in high school. Too bad you slept through it. Oh, shit. Com complimented on her extremely good looks. El pesto la guardia. Guardia se spermo bubito. You tell her? No. The spaghetti and the guard say jizz boobs. I guess an attempt at jizz boobs. She seems genuinely interested in you. Your Spanish must not be bad after all. It's horrible. Si, esa luna el gros. It poopy dog. Doggy la bambino la señorita reporitos. This fucking Spanish is horrible, bro. Well, speaking is one thing, but understanding her is com is another. Her response baffles you completely. You, must, you have no idea what she means. Of course, that never stopped you before. El pincel, pincelio, es tub tubular, rigido, amarillo. No, that would not be El... El hombre de la nostra de don, donde estas ma, madura signale. I'll use that pencil line. There you go. La rito de estupero sententates. La señorita charma. So you find here, I thought you'd never show up. By the way, who writes these secret phrases anyways? La, la microficie, la in, inin, big deal on... Onklonk, no touche. Dr. Nonuki El Kami. The mic, Jesus. The microfish containing the secrets to the recent <coughs> United States superconductor research breakthrough is hidden <coughs> inside this rare Peruvian Onklonk. Don't let anyone touch it before you personally deliver it to Dr. Nonuki. And I don't need to tell you, but be careful. He and he alone has the authority to deliver this to the USSR agents. Grazie, grazie. Muchas gracias, la señorita. That's not what you said. You said thank you very much, lady. Ma'am. As the best as you can tell, she wants you to keep an unusual instrument on the counter. She wants you to keep that unusual instrument, musical instrument on the counter. So rather than risk an offender, you generously, you take it. Have a nice, buenos dias. Oh shit, G Money. Say, what an interesting car you think. How does he make it do that? Hydraulic lifts. I don't know. I better save though. Let's go talk to this. You sort of you know some unusual looking man beside the car. He doesn't fail to notice you. Oh, I bet that's one of the gives you a short head to start and then follows you. This guy is up to no good. Why am I running away? I might have fucked up when I just saved right there. Wait a minute, what's this? How can you bit the door to me when you just walked off screen to the right? That must be someone who looks just like you. Something strange is going on here. Let's follow him into the music shop and see what we can learn. What? What do you mean back here? Says the clerk skipping the foreign language subtitles. Welcome back. You missed a lot, actually. Missioning again. What are you talking about? I've never seen you before in my entire life, says the dorky looking guy beside you're not supposed to talk to me like that before we change our cute little secret phrases. What do you mean? She responds. You just walked out the door over there. Not me, he exclaims. Hey, wait a minute. Don't tell me you gave the goods to someone else. I sure uh, I'm not sure that it's maybe I don't I'm, 
Her voice trembles with fear. You fucking dolt. I'm sorry, he fits your description perfectly. He said the secret code phrases as well. Although we didn't come to think of it, he did have a terrible accent. I thought he had a bad accent. Might be... Have been a part of your disguise. Oh, shit. Now what will I do? She continues. Dr. Nonuki is gonna... Does not tolerate mistakes. With her... Her eyes flash when I die. Of course. If you promise to help me, I won't let you... I won't, I won't tell him how you lost the microfish. Why, you... He threatens. If you know what's good for you, you'll shut this joint down. Contact... Nontunit... Island... And get the troops started finding this guy. They'll guarantee he has no tells about your little indiscretion. If you can retrieve the microfish before he discovers what he has, Dr. No Nookie might even allow you to live a few extra days. Uh oh. She deliberates uh, just a moment before making her decision. You're right, of course. You see, you can follow him while I contact the island by radio telephone. Well, Larry, this is certainly another fine match you've gotten into. Not only is the KBG after, KGB after you, what was supposed to be theirs, the Dr. No Nookie's beautiful army of henchettes, game show hostess, church secretaries, and now bimbos are now hot on your trail. Since we've now learned the worst, we'll rejoin you as you wander through Los Angeles. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get on that fucking boat. Did you have a good time over there at uh, Hyro Stream? That shit was funny. I popped my head over there for a second and <laughs> saw that y'all was like, I guess he was asking. Rank Schlemiel. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Where the fuck is the place at? Up oh hell no, bro. Huh? Stay on me, ninja. Farted a lot, but I was it was fun. How am I supposed to get there? Run, bitch, run. All right. Oh, here we go. Let's go. 
Let's fucking go. Well, nice photo, he says sarcastically. Now let's see if your ticket's in order. Ah, oh, jeez, another freebie. One of these suits gonna start marketing. Gonna realize these boats don't sell on wind power. Oh, I'm sorry, it's not your fault. Regaining his composure, he continues, your cabin will be on deck F cabin number one. That'll be all the way below decks and to the rear. This will give you an excellent opportunity to hear all the subtle inflections in our, of our diesels. You may now enter. Oh, that bird just tried to shit on me, bro. Rank Nimrod. Wee! Party on, dudes! Oh shit! What's up, Sugar Lips? So upset of you. Your thoughts are on your search. Will you find love, or just keep looking in all the wrong places? o'clock oh shit uh This is surely Unlux, located at the rear of the lowest deck of the noise and is deafening. You have a bed, a nightstand, and a small closet. There's a door in the wall on the aft wall. Maybe there's another... Di uh. I feel like I'm going to need that. Oh shit, who's this? Well, 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 what have we here? Says the woman on the bed. Uh, you've been caught in someone else's estate room. Why do I believe it's that darling young man that my daughter won on TV? Hold up. Hold up. Moms? We got a, we got a cougar. We got a MILF. Good lord, she's Bachelor brother, Barbara's mother. Poor little Barbie got the feeling sick just as we, the cruise was about to start. So I decided to borrow her ticket and come along instead. Oh. Your mind quickly envisions Paradise Lost. I hope you don't mind. I convinced the purser that it was in his best interest to assign us to adjoining cabinets. I'm sure I can make your voyage enjoyable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I really want to get to know you. If you get my drift. After I saw you win that lottery, I thought you was... Just about the cutest thing I had ever seen. Except for my mister, of course. May he rest in peace. He was a good man. And usually quite sturdy. But one day his heart just couldn't take it anymore. You wonder why it's necessary for anyone to learn this? Honey, anytime you want to come over and see mama, you just feel free to pop you on in through that door, you hear? 
a cute and girlish smile. She fails. Let's see what she's looking at. Oh, okay. <laughs> you find women sexy, but in this case, you... Aww. What is she cute, though? Wow, Sonny, shrieks Big Mama. I thought you were never going to come over here. Sit on the bed here while slipping to something more comfortable. I bet you'd like a little mink link. A little mink lined leather special, wouldn't you? Now get your comfort. Now you get comfortable in those chromium chains and handcuffs conveniently attached to the four corners of the bed. Mama proceeds to have her way with you repeatedly. Too bad that her way is not your way. You can see why this broad's a widow. What? Whoa! No. <laughs> they said nobody wants to play that game right now. Alright, we go in, we say hi, we get the fuck out. What well, we have here? Da 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 Mm-mm. Run, motherfucker, run. Bye. Fuck. Push. Oh, we're going to push this in there. I can't believe I just got fucking railroaded like that, bro. I was just walking over to see what was up. Oh, shit. Fucking W's right there. Many things I refer to Lonnie must, must be a policewoman as she also has handcuffs, whips, chains, and other paraphernalia that you assume would only be used in the field of law enforcement. Can I handcuff, whips, chains? I don't think I'll need anything else.
<coughs> I don't want to play this game no more. Uh, did I put on sunscreen? About to go above deck, boys. Can I go this way? Oh shit. Okay. Seems like a lovely day to catch a few rays. Good thing you applied that sunscreen. I kind of figured that was going to be the case. Uh oh. That, that. Why, well, hello there, big fella. You big, beautiful. The big, beautiful. The, the big. The beautiful blonde with the body like a brick shipyard. Why are you hanging around here? I've been looking for someone just like you for a long time. Suspect. Why don't you come back to my place and you won't have to hang out around here all alone ever again? You finally found a, a live one. Come on, Samson. I can't wait to get you alone. Uh... I don't think so, homie. Fuck that. Take a dip, yeah. Oh, shit. I got a big ass. I'm coming up. Oops, what? Anybody missing a bikini? What do I do? Go back to my cabin?
Going next to this fucking serial killer, y'all. Let's go see if we can find a bar. Riddle me this. What's up? Dim bulb? <laughs> what was the C thing? Was that C, C thing just now a riddle? I don't know. Alright. Why don't you join hands and try communicating with the living, she asked directly. The bar. We're all out of that. Would you like a mixed drink? Do you have any drinks with parasols and fruit, you asked the bartender? But of course, allow me to fix you the specialty of the house. Heavy on the pineapple, okay? No problem, he says. Somehow I would have guessed that. Here's to you. Walk. Yeah, when ready to continue. And da 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 da. Yeah, another cruise ship. Yeah, another cruise ship does. What the fuck? Aha, I got you. I got you, you vicious devil enemy of the people, cries the bartender, subtly revealing himself as a cage member of the KGB. How's that extra pineapple, you sap? Does that effect upon your central nervous system? You get the cage, you know, problems during the transit, local to headquarters will drop. Alright, well. Don't do that. When ready to get it. Epic fail. Don't order a drink. Complimentary? Okay. The barber shop.
Where, where must... I'm a hoser now. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Oh, it's this guy again. What the fuck? Have exactly what you need, he tells you. It's all the rage, the latest thing. You see it everywhere these days. In fact, guys make a lot of money with one of these. I call it the Jimmy model. And I'm sure you'll find, like it just fine. He places the Jimmy carefully on your head. This fool just put a mop on my fucking dome, son. Impeccable fit, he cries. And for you, the price is right. Only $10,000. But I like to consider it more of an investment than an expense. Ten k for a wig? Oh, well, it's not like it's your money. Why not let those suckers who paid all these lucko buck tickets treat you to a new loot? I'll take it. You tell them, peel off a hundred, a hundred hundreds from your rapidly depleting. Huh, huh. I look like fucking Jimmy Taggart or Swaggart or whatever. Have a nice day. Look yourself in the mirror of the pack and you put it back in your jacket. <laughs> I mean, it looked good ish. What's up here? Oh, shit. Uh. Start the large toggle switch at the start position. A fainting sound ticking. Uh oh. Through your ineptitude, you've allowed your captain to be killed by the KGN. Unbeknown to the passengers of the cruise ship, now charged in his own course, a chorus of course of straits in the nearest reef. As you miss a reef and miss the grief, save the ship and save the day. Perhaps you'll even. S nah, no way. You knew better than that. Um. Do I get the spinach? No. Everybody's trying to kill me on this motherfucker. Dim bulb. I'm getting kind of hungry. <laughs> When's the last time I ate today? Oh, that's right. When I ate your mom. Ah. Look at me. I'm Jimmy Swaggart. From television's Jimmy Swaggart. And 
we'll go this way instead. So da 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 and the go down the steps and then walk east to the top deck and go to the next set of steps on about a quarter of the world of the steps walk west to the upper deck. Oh, I see. Okay. So you made it to the light boat in the nick of time. Let's go. Slowly you drift away from the cruise ship. You wonder if you ever what you forgot to pack. Uh oh. Oh, you're so fucking distraught. As the USS Love Tub Ship sinks the way it slows the rise when we rejoin our noble hero in his latest predicament. Isn't it funny how time flies when you're in, when you're having fun? One. Boy, the sun is hot. Oh, did I forget to, re do I need to, re oh, no. I think that's about it for me, guys. <sighs> I've been streaming, what, five hours? I think I'm going to kick out of here. Um, I'm going to try to decide on when I want to do these streams. And then what the next stream will be about. Yeah, it's already been five hours. It's crazy, bro. Crazy. Good shit. Hell yeah. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I'll keep everybody in touch. Now, just keep your eye on the stream. We'll probably pick up right where we left off. But, yeah, it's 1.30. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten in at least fucking nine hours. But with that being said, everybody, much love, much love. I will catch you on the flip. Oh, shit. Thank you for everybody coming in. 
Thanks for even those who are hanging out. You don't even have to say none. Appreciate it. I appreciate everything. Love you guys.